what is up everyone c casting here and i'm finally back with another tds video it's been months since i've last uploaded and that's because i've had a lot of things going on in my life a lot of transitions but it doesn't matter we are back here in tds with a completely new look and i'm gonna be honest i haven't played this game in months too like the last time i played this game is the last time i've recorded so i i have no idea what's going on i mean i remember buying these skins and i don't even know if i made a video on these ones i don't know if i finished it or not it's just it's been so long i don't even remember but there is a ton of things that i need to check out and i'm actually gonna go into this video blind i just hopped in right now i got a few comments saying when are you gonna upload and i said soon but besides the point we are gonna be exploring this little lobby area and then hopping into a game or two so we have a tower release apparently in the next what is that two weeks i'm tripping two days oh dude and this map is actually crazy like i remember this the, the old map it used to be very tiny but this map is freaking huge now i wonder what's going on here we have a little city so i guess these are all the creators of the game that's pretty awesome and they have billboards up there too so it's a really cool map that we have all the engineers here and stuff we have our daily store i'm missing new towers so there's a necromancer reach level 50 to unlock the tower i wonder what level i am I thought, it was I thought it was pretty high level too. I don't have enough coins for this, which is kind of unfortunate, but I do have this elf camp. What is this? What, what towers do I have? That is a, oh, okay. Let's get rid of this guy. This guy sucks. I also heard that military base got changed. So our loadout is looking like accelerator, gladiator, the military base, the elf camp, and our farm. So let's do that. That seems pretty good. Let's get right into it. Survival. Let's see if, oh. I guess I just kicked that man out, but I've never played this map. It looks pretty cool, so we're just gonna play it right away. We're gonna explore around a little bit, and hopefully it makes a decent, a decent TDS video. This map looks pretty tiny, looks pretty compact, so that's a good and bad thing. Can't place too many towers, but we can place a couple. And they can probably hit the whole, the whole area. I haven't played in so long, I forgot how the game even runs. That's, oh, and I fell out the map. That's amazing. And we're back. All right, so let's upgrade one of these, I guess. Yeah, it seems pretty good. We might want a gladiator soon, but not too soon. And we should be pretty good. Let's check out this map. So we have a little gas station here. We have our wanted zombie that escaped reward is only $10. You know what you could buy with $10? You can buy that plushie. You think it's $10? I didn't even see the price. That's okay, we'll just get our gladiator here on this corner here. Let's get him like there. That seems pretty good. To be able to handle all these guys. So them two alone should be able to hold us off for a good minute. And then we can start saving for accelerators. Maybe start, or actually, you know what? I wanna see the, the base. That's what I wanna see actually. So we can actually afford one right now. So let's just place it. Probably horrible placing by the way. But I do love the military base. I do love using it. So this is actually pretty fun for me. Let's also get another farm in here. So we want our money. But so far, we're looking pretty good. We're, we're destroying all these zombies. We've only lost a couple lives. We have a good amount of money. And I want to get another military base. And then probably one more farm. Okay, so we have, we have now these three upgraded. Oh, here it comes. Yeah, so look, it got a remodel. That's actually a really good remodel. It looks really nice. It, it has some animations to it. That's awesome, bro. I love it. I love it. That's actually really nice. I love it a lot. Watch. It's going to take out all these gray zombies. Oh, oh, shoot. <laughs> it just, it just exploded out of nowhere. That was a crazy, crazy explosion. Very vicious. They, they explode so brutally. Watch. It's going to, let's skip the next round so we can see. We're going to see a brutal explosion on these speedy zombies or not. Boom. Bro, that's so brutal. It's so vicious. That's crazy. I love it. I love the military base. I love these Humvees. And I have two grand somehow. I don't even know how I got two grand. I need to stay on top of my money. You know what? TDS kind of brings you a sense of peace. You're kind of just chilling here. You're watching your towers work. You're watching all your money get gathered. And you know, you're kind of just buying, reinvesting into these towers and just winning. This is what I love about this game. It brings a sense of peace because you don't really have to do too much, but you're also doing enough. So. TDS, there you go. So we're gonna have one with barbed wire now. And we're gonna we're gonna also have one with a mounted gunner. So here's the one with the barbed wire. Looking very, very fire. Wrapped around there on the bumper. 
still taken out, but he only has 10 HP left, so that's a good sign. We should get our gunner one here, so I want to see what that one looks like. Oh, okay, so he's just mounted on the back there. That's awesome. And it looks like it, he, he does 5 damage per shot, because I only heard 2 shots there. He looks very chill, though. I see those sunglasses. We should probably also upgrade our farms to make some more money. And I think we're I think we're doing really good. I think we're we're doing really solid right now. I forgot what wave it goes to, you know, because your boy's going to college, so so I, I've been dealing with all that and I've forgotten all about TDS. But it's alright. Oh, next tier is a tank for eight thousand. And that's a crazy upgrade. So they go to 10 damage, 500 health, and have explosive damage. Airstrike ability? What does that mean? They get airstrikes? I might have to save up for that. Airstrike ability. Yeah, I think I'm going to save for that. Airstrike ability? That sounds insane. $8,000 down the drain. Oh, we do right here. Whoa. Okay, wait. Hold on. I don't want to try it on these guys yet because... You know, they're, it's, it's going to be useless. They're going to be taken out right now. That's the round right there. We're going to pre-fire this. Oh, shoot. Bro, that thing just came flying in. It, I didn't even get a chance to react. It just came flying in and it just bombed them. Holy, that's crazy. <laughs> that is very crazy. Okay, definitely worth it. Definitely worth it. Let's honestly save for this 24,000. This railgun tank, this guy goes to 24 damage. 1500 health, 80 explosive damage, 750 airstrike damage, and a bigger airstrike explosive range. So let's buy that. The factory looking crazy good, crazy futuristic. Here it comes. Let's get that airstrike again. There it goes. Boom, stealth bomber, and they're all gone. So honestly, I, I don't even need accelerator. Tanks got it. The tanks got it. This guy is probably like, hey, where's my upgrade? I'm sorry, dude. You don't get an upgrade, but it's okay because you'll be upgraded soon. But this guy, Railgun Tank, is doing all the damage. It's insane. Look at that. Just zapping him away. Disintegrated. Let's get an elf base in here because why not? We're going to have bomber elves. Let's get some of those. Let's get some guardian elves, of course. Let's get some ripped elves. Yeah. And oh, that's fully upgraded. Okay. We're also going to upgrade this guy to our Railgun Tank. We're just going to demolish the competition. We have two airstrikes. We might as well use that. Boom, boom. Use another one because we can. Just absolutely destroy everything in its path. I'm loving this. I'm loving this. We're going to upgrade this guy to max. Now we have two towers. We're going to get another and another and another and one more. Oh, never mind. We can only have five. I guess, right, because it's two OP, so, you know, we can only have so much power. But we're gonna upgrade them. We're gonna upgrade them. We're gonna airstrike all of these guys. We're gonna spam that. Boom, 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 boom. It don't even, it doesn't even matter, bro. Just demolish. Bombs after bombs, tanks after tanks. I mean, this is crazy. We have a, we have freaking Sen over here. <laughs> Sen is chucking bombs on these zombies. I mean, we got the whole U.S. military. I mean, these gliders haven't had action since the beginning waves. That's how good these guys are. So we can only have two elf camps because I guess these ripped elves are too OP and Santa's chucking too many presents. So I guess, you know, we do have to tone it down a little bit. I could sit here for the rest of the time, probably not even use my airstrikes and still win because that's how good these tanks are. That's how good these elves are. That's how good the accelerators are. That's how good the the gladiators are so we got the whole team it's a whole team effort i think we're about to get the boss we're just gonna skip the wave because we can i mean these guys aren't even standing a chance and apparently these are the boss's henchmen we're gonna have our airstrikes ready we're gonna see how fast we can kill that boss we don't even have max we have one or two accelerators so we'll see we're gonna send in all our bombs that didn't actually really do any damage and all of our towers are down because he is stunned but that's okay because our elves are going insane look at these guys they're it's like a machine gun look at that health it's going down like crazy i think we got in the bag at least i hope this tank is about to take out a good chunk of damage there we go all these rail guns going insane accelerator shredding that this is insane for the tanks to do this much damage and the elf tower i mean this tank re rebuild i think it's the tank rebuild is doing insane because last time i checked the tanks were not this good but now they are absolutely insane let's use more airstrikes and it, that pretty much demolished all of his health right there 
and that's it. There we go. As easy as that. All you need is five ra railgun tanks, maybe eight farms, two accelerators, two elf bases, and eh, two two gladiators. Let's say two gladiators. And there we go. 17 minutes, 24 seconds. U turn. We got our 500 coins, and we won. So let's return back to lobby. I think I'll call it there for the next video. I want you guys to tell me what I should do, what towers I should use, if I should play a game mode. I remember I used, I did that spinning wheel video, just doing pretty good. So if you guys want to see that again, and maybe any updates that I missed. So, anyways, thank you guys so much. I really appreciate you guys sticking around, and I'll see you guys on the next one. And like I said, let me know. Bye, guys.